Yo yo, this is Dover Black Hat Gaming. I do RPG games like Elder Scrolls and Fallout and many more. Subscribe to see more and enjoy the video. We are Lord Boethius Faithful. Have you come to test your metal? The Lord of Plots, Deceiver of Nations, Devourer of Trinum, the King of Shadows, Goddess of Destruction, He who destroys, and She who erases. Many are our Lord's lofty names, but they befit only us mortals. Intone her mighty names from now until the end of time. It is her. Names mean nothing to our Lord. She only cares for those who care for themselves, whose hearts are full of purpose, whose lives are full of deeds. If you desire a glimpse of our dark mysteries, then this is what you must do. First, prove your tongue can wield a lie. Find someone, gain his trust, lead him to the shrine above. Next, instruct your thrall to touch the Pillar of Sacrifice. Its magic will ensnare him, rendering him helpless. Then, girded with certitude, plant the ceremonial blade deeply, so that the waters of his heart will be shown. If your will is strong enough, it will stir Boethia in her dark mansion, and she will appear before you. That remains to be seen, but if it is so, and if Boethia appears, then we will welcome you as one. What can I get for you? All right, what is it? What do you need? I knew it. <sighs> Do you know what you're getting yourself into? I know Boethia, and this priestess has definitely explained enough of her at least. Just think about it. You're being asked to lie or enthrall a friend, not just any old stranger, but someone you probably already know. Lead them on with false promises to this altar, while they'll be sacrificed in a deplorable Daedric ritual. All just to summon the Daedric Prince of Deceit, Conspiracy, and Murder. Supposedly, you'll get a great reward. Either fame, power, or whatever dark deed you'd like fulfilled. Let's say it's granted. There will surely be a catch. Like, lifelong service, for example. I don't need to elaborate what that means. You'd also be bringing an innocent soul into this. Manipulating them just for your own ends. You'd be no better than my father and mother. Good. I don't want you to hurt any of your friends. And I also don't want to relive a Daedric ritual. One of any sort. Yes. How can you even move around in that? It looks awful to even put on. Then it's true, what everyone is saying. That Aventus Artino is doing the Black Sacrament, trying to summon the Dark Brotherhood? Oh, Grimbar, always with the nonsense. No, no, of course not. Those are just tales. Fine, then I'll invite him out to play. He lives right there. I'm going to knock on his door. No, child. Wait! That boy, that house, they are cursed. Ha! Then I'm right. I knew it. He's trying to have somebody killed. All right. I won't deny it, child. What you heard is true. But Aventus Aretino walks a dark path, and his actions can lead only to ruin. Now, enough. We will speak no more of this. I am the only friend you need. Sweet 
mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me. For the sins of your Lord, you must be baptized in blood and fear. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Grow on, you old crone. You'll get what you deserve. The Dark Brotherhood will see to that. Die, Grow on, die! Please, how long must I do this? I keep praying, Night Mother. Why won't you answer me? Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Finally, my prayers have been answered. It worked. I knew you'd come. I just knew it. I did the black sacrament over and over with the body and the things, and then you came, an assassin from the Dark Brotherhood. Of course you are. I prayed, and you came, and now you'll accept my contract. My mother, she, she died. I, I'm all alone now. So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften, Honor Hall. The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. They call her Grella the kind, but she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us. So I ran away and came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're here, and you could kill Grelod the Kind. Sorry. To be honest, I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall, I really miss my friends there. Yes? Very well. Hey, we need to talk. I'm not sure we should be doing this. That Aventus. I don't think he knows what he's doing. Dealing with assassinations at such a young age. Back on the island, in the midst of a Daedra worshipping cult, as a little girl, I never did any of these things. By sure, I never did the sacrament or attempted to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Isn't there another way? What did you need? Those who shirk their duties will get an extra beating. Do I make myself clear? I guess this is yes, the place. Yes, do what you have to do. One more thing. I will hear no more talk of adoptions. None of you riffraff is getting adopted, ever. Nobody needs you. Nobody wants you. That, my darlings, is why you're here. Why you will always be here, until the day you come of age and get thrown into that wide, horrible world. Now, what do you all say? We, we love, love you, girl, and thank you for, your, you kind for your, kindness. your kindness. That's better. Now scurry off, my little gutter snipes. You really shouldn't be here. Sadly, yes. Even the townsfolk have taken to calling her Grelod the Kind. Her very existence has become something of a running joke. Grelod runs this orphanage because she's old, and set in her ways and doesn't know any other life. 
These children need love and comfort. I try. But I'm sorry. You should go. The children aren't up for adoption, and it's cruel to get their hopes up. Besides, Grella hates visitors. If there's nothing else, I really must ask you to leave. I'm sorry, but the children aren't up for adoption right now. You should go. What do you want? You have no business being in here. What are you staring at, you worthless piece of gutter trash? I simply must start locking the doors again. Think you can intimidate me? In my own orphanage? Ha! Not bloody likely. Huh? I do hope Mommy and Father come to get me soon. Ever since that Aventus boy left, Grillet has been so angry. Yes, Grelod. Roar's crying. It's keeping me up at night. I'll give you one chance to talk the tears out of him, or he's getting the belt. Please just let me handle it. It's not a problem. Do it. I just knew it! I knew the Dark Brotherhood would save me! Here, just like I promised, this should fetch you a nice price. Uh, thank you. Thank you again! I never really understood why some people would prefer to pad themselves with more metal. Yes, their figure is more sturdy, but now they're much easier to hit. So, what now? I agree. Let's get some sleep. Hope everyone enjoyed the video, like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the bell icon. See you all on the next video. Enjoy life. Instant.